happening? Well, um, the analysis is on with regards to the 2023 elections. And guess what? The analysis shows that Peter Obi has gathered more momentum than Atiku and Tinubu. The former APC steward, Mazu Majigi, gives full details. He says they are work, watching the political terrain. And don't forget that they are still castigating Nigerian YouTube, that um, they are doing social media promotion of Peter Obi and that it will go nowhere. Their promotion of Peter will be on social media. It's just on social media. There's nothing more to it. It's a social media campaign. And Nigerians are sincerely wondering, what do you mean by social media campaign? Do you mean to tell me that um, it's all about social media? Uh, and can't you see the effect the social media is really making in this country? Or do you think that, you know, it's just... <clears throat> you know some people, eh, they will never believe until they see like they say they say seeing is believing no matter what you say no they can't be convinced so it will take more for them to be convinced and so this is what he's saying he said uh, for currently right now what we see peter obiu eh, has done more than you can anticipate for campaign wise is is more there than peter obi and tinubu Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's see on which ground he's been able to get this analysis ongoing. 2023, Peter Obi has gathered more momentum than Atiku and Tinubu, former APC steward, Mazi Majiga reveals. Were the three leading candidates for president having selected their respective running mates, Analysis has begun assessing their respective chances in the upcoming 2023 national elections. Earlier today, former Kano State Commissioner for Works, Halaji Mazi Majiga, said on Chinese television, Sunrise Daily, the Labour Party presidential candidate, Peter Obi, has more supporters from vote, voters than major party candidates. It says the major party candidates include that of the People Democratic Party PDP, flag bearer Atiku Abubakar, and All Progressive Congress APC, Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu. Maji, a former member of the APC campaign council, went on to say that the 2023 presidential election will be very different from the ones that just took place because not only do the masses want something different from what the current administration has given them, but there is also an unpredicted number of new voters entering the picture. The former commissioner claims that Peter Obi has done a better job than any of the other candidates appealing to the yearning of the people. In reality, there are quarreling and agreements that even if Atiku has connected has connected it as it should be obi has done it more effectively but why Konkoso is keeping an eye on things in the north peter obi is busy making a difference maji has said so this is um, an analogy so somebody from the north who can see critically that um, with all that is currently on ground peter obi may be standing a shoulder above others well, like we will say, all this again are speculations. What are we doing to ensure that it becomes a reality? All these things are saying, okay, oh, Peter will be did this, he did that. Okay, it's good. And don't get it wrong. You know, don't get me wrong at all. It's good. If you believe Peter will be is the one, please, please, please go ahead and vote for him. I will say it again. Go ahead and vote for him. But the truth must remain. If you want Peter Obi to win, he cannot win without you standing for what is right. He can only win with you, okay, with you voting for him. That win can never come if you don't do the right thing. It will never come. It will just be a figment of your imagination that never came to be. Okay? Don't be a social media person alone talking about what Peter Obi has done or what he shouldn't have done, what Tinubu have done or what he should have done, what Atiku has done or what Atiku should have done. 
Go out there, get your PVC. That's the starting point. Go get your PVCs. When you have successfully get, gotten your PVC, then you can begin your own personal campaign. The campaign will begin in NS. The campaign will begin in NS. Do you understand? Then the campaign will begin. So these are some of the things, you know, okay, that are, that, are, that are going on and why Nigerians, we cannot afford to lose another chance of making a real, a real, choosing a real person as our, as our president. Because whoever becomes the president of this country, I put it to you, we determine how things will go on for another couple of years. Not year, years. And the person that we choose again, huh? Do we want a repeat of another Buhari? Here is you and I. Buhari's children, not one school in the, in the country. Now, I'm, I don't have a problem with him picking a preference for where his students should have school. Don't get me wrong. What I'm saying is, it's okay if you want your children to school abroad. But please, you are in the position to ensure that the educational system in the country is running the way it should. So that those back at home, schooling the, the university of the country are not your own do not have a better or an edge over them that's what i'm saying that's the point i'm trying to make if you feel me that's the point i'm trying to make don't go there and prepare so your own now have a better edge and advantage over the other no 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 we're not making our country great by doing that at all we're not we're not we're putting our country in a very bad light the nations of the world will be wondering what is going on with us. The nations of the world will be wondering what's going on with us. It's not right at all. In any way, form or kind, it's not right. And the best time for us to begin to amend and begin to, you know, make sure that things are different is now. So that we can move forward. If we don't, okay, things will be terrible and bad. And we will not like what we come out of it. You won't like it, I won't like it, we won't like it. Look at Buhari's administration. Where are the jobs? For those who have gone to school and have studied, where are the jobs? For those who have done well, where are the jobs? It is what it is. It is high time we begin to make that difference. God bless. Bye for now. Remember you have a voice. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us. Share. Subscribe. Bye.